to Stephanie Ria to My Hero Academia. Well, this will be My Hero Academia Season 4, Episode 7. Go! Well, last episode, we found out the baddies. <laughs> I forget their names. Using that we last say Aria or Mary or Airy. Using her flesh and all that to make bullets. Because maybe her quirk is to negate other people's quirks. And because of that, they're using parts of her flesh and all that. And they bullets and hurting her. That's why we've seen that arm all banded to stop before. And we've seen Midoriya and Miriam all like feeling bad about themselves. They couldn't help her before. So, yikes. We come as a Zawa. Helping them and all that, and help with all the other students that were in this meeting. You see them, don't call me a eh, Don't call me Mr. Zawa, just call me a razor head. Because that's who I am outside school. So, yeah, that's what's going on. 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 Yeah, to find the enemies. You gotta maybe stop them from getting the bullets. I don't know. So I wanna go and watch this. How many go points I can get. So let's ready and start and go I got another reason then. At Red Riot's debut fight, I saw something new. Tamaki was shot, and the bullet contains some kind of drug I've never heard of before. One that destroys quirks. And when we analyze the substance from the bullet... Yeah. We've made a thorough list of groups with connections to the Saikai, as well as properties owned by the organization. This is our starting point. I would like you all to investigate each coordinate on this map. It is the most logical way to narrow down our targets. Alright, this looks promising. As you investigate possible locations, consider the following criteria. One, is this a place where quirk-destroying bullets could be manufactured? Two, do people and goods go in and out frequently? Three, has the area seen a recent influx in illegal drugs? The Saikai has a plan in place. They're working quickly and quietly to carry it out. We must proceed with utmost care moving forward. Tsukuchi, how are things on your end? All right, keep looking and let us know what you find. The first half of the list turned up nothing. They've got to be hiding the girls. Aerie, we'll protect you this time. We'll save you, Aerie. Yes, you did, Victoria. I promise! <laughs> well, it looks like we're yeah. in for sunshine today, so get out there and enjoy the nice weather. And me? I know Tokoyami's still, still off in Kyushu. <laughs> You ended up using foresight anyway? If you recall, I said I'd use it when our path was more certain. Yeah. Whatever. This means we've got the data we need, right? Yes. And we know for sure when they'll be there, thanks to our stakeouts. <laughs> we also worked with the police and already got a warrant to search the place. Next step is to barge in there. Oh man, that's my line. Hey, Deku. Come 
Come on, Midoriya. We're all over this. Let's rescue that girl. Take down some bad guys. Yeah. Good. Seems like he's back to normal. Mirio. Now then, let's begin. Keep watch. A bunch have been gathering since early this morning. The police are backing them up. Boss, it sounds like they figured out where we are. So they're coming. Proceed according to plan. You got it, sir. Prepare yourself. Right. Where are you going? You're laughing, you got to move up. To take care of- Who's the bloody in a gun over there that fast? That's how bad girls would probably think. But, cause he's only got a training job, Midoriya, and some of his friends are, they're all getting trained and using their right new techniques they're learning there. And try to save this leave you last here, Aria. Aria. Wait, Aria. Aria. Her name is. See, I'm not good with names, but anyway, they waited to try to save her, but they couldn't do anything until contacted, and they weren't allowed to tell anybody about the mission. I agree with that, I can't tell anyone about your mission. It's like, you've, if you're on a secret mission with some heroes, and some and a friend of yours, well, what have you been up to? Oh, I've been doing this, I've been doing this. Then they spread out on somebody else. Did you hear about that person? They were doing this and that. Then it gets out. The villains get to know. And stuff. See? You can't tell anybody case it's a leak by mistake. There could be a leak in the school. And we don't know this. A, a, a villain pretending to be a teacher. Pretending to be a superhero. Or a superhero gone bad. It could be. So, when Doria's friend asked him, are you alright? Then, yeah, I'm alright, hi. Then, we, then he, he seen Midori not eating his food properly. Like that. One thing, I'm no good with names. I want to say like Tenzin, but I think Tenzin is Cora. I'll probably get it oh, there's there. Ida I said Ida asked him uh, are you alright and stuff and so did uh, I'm bad with these names aren't I? Sikarak no it's just Sikarak Sikarak is the body it's Toroki I'm trying to think his name I knew who he was but I couldn't think his name I've got any characters names still here on my phone Toroki asked him if he was alright and stuff, then tried to cheer him up. And Midori burst out greeting. Mm. Poor wee guy, I want to give him a hug. He feel like they're like, come here, son. And give him a hug and cause he's crying and stuff. Oh, bless. Bless my cotton socks. Oh. But he's, he does say to him, friends tell each other anything about anything's worrying. Don't forget you told me that. But then he says to him, Dory says to him, I know either, but we are friends, we can't, I can't tell you this, I can't. He says inside his head. So either and Totoroki shared their food with Midoriya. That was kind of them, but you didn't have to do that. Midoriya, Midoriya ate all your food, and now he's taking food off others. But I'm guessing, if you got to be a hero, or especially the number one hero, you just got to try to do that. He has to get all his strength up. He has to. Oh. And the group and the police and the heroes found where. I'm going to try this again. Yakazai. Yakazai. Whatever it is. Yakazua. Yeah, probably Yakazai. Whatever it is. They were hiding. And why they were hiding in Airy. Okay. Because we've seen. Night Eye using his foresight on one of the villains when he was buying a, that doll with a princess doll for her when we seen him gain her that. So he told the other heroes that 
Pat Gum, if you're the one where he was hiding. But again then, somehow a leak got out. Somebody said somebody said to them, the police and the heroes know where we are. We have to do something fast. So the leader of that group sent all the underlings to go fight while he did escape to take the airy. Like I said, like I said, watch us, go grab her. The heroes and all that'll show up, Midoriya and that'll show up, and she'll be gone. So that's what I'm asking about there, where you get there, yeah, the villains, where you get her. But something about his father, I feel his father in like a, a hospital bed or something. He's done that's right, Papa. He's only allowed noises you'll hear. Hmm. And that made me think. Maybe it's not just his daughter he's using to make the boots. Maybe it's his papa he's using to. Maybe his quirk and her bones of flesh and parts of her. Or her quirk and parts of his father. And that's what made me think of that. Oh. So it's, it's a good episode. But it's really tough for us. Let's see what the next one's called, the next episode. Mm, pictures. No, that's pictures. Videos. My Hero Academia, season 4. Episode 8 is called... Sun Eater of the Big Three. Sun Eater. Is that to do with it, maybe? That one of the big three guys, when he eats things, maybe a Cassonia eats something. To do with the sun, like sun, sunrise, juice, or something. Maybe he gets sunrise power. I don't know. Just his sunrise. Sun eater of the big three. Aye, uh, so, or it could be Sun Eater. It says Sun Eater in one word, so it could be Sun Eater of the Big Three. That could be that guy's name, maybe. The guy's always scared, but people always say it's one thing to him. Oh! To make him. It might be, because he, uh, he was hit last time with a bullet and stuff. And he lost his powers for an hour or two. Because the drugs they used on them didn't work well. But I think I don't know if it was the extra week clip at the end or the next time trailer we saw like one of the underlings people using one of the drugs on themselves and he was getting bigger. The wee penguin guy. So that could be something to do with that too. Maybe. And we saw one of the, one of the big three guys, the scary one. We get a cool arms, get like an octopus. That's what I said, doing it too. You probably need some octopus things, maybe a, a set of wings from whatever else, to grab the lassie, and maybe fly away. We never saw any wings, just saw the octopus tentacle. So, and, I think it was fat gum, we get him swordfish food, and gets not to turn his arm into a, a sword. Or maybe that's the day give him the, the squid tentacle, maybe. But that's no swordfish, that's octopus. That is a squid. Yeah. And if you notice anything different about my reaction, I'm doing it on a Polaroid camera. Instead of my laptop camera. So I found that my laptop camera is alright. But when I do my edits, it blurs them. I find that it's not getting blurry much. I'm doing it on this Polaroid camera. Well, everyone, well, thank you for watching this reaction. Don't forget to hit a like button, subscribe down below, comment if you want. Hitting the like button bounces my reactions up. It does to get more people. And then I can probably get a bit of camera and stuff when I get money in and that. I'm going to get paid next week, I think. But. I'm planning to get a new laptop and maybe a better editing system. Meh. 
So yeah, as soon as I get new tools, I'll be doing a lot of new things. Watch out YouTube. Here I come. <laughs> but at the minute, I'm still using my old laptop from 11 years ago. But anyway everyone, have a good day, good night, good week, good weekend. Stay safe everyone, and I'll see you next week for episode 8. Bye.